Moin Khan, Razak, Basim Akram, the Kenzie, Callis, Cronier, Crooks, all can bat. Oh, that's a good shot. Brilliant shot. Wasn't that short. One bounce and it's over the boundary road. Pakistan 12 without loss. Just short of third man. Oh, a late decision there to dive forward. Steve Elworthy was going to block it all the way and then he suddenly thought, gee, I've got a chance of catching this. And because he made a late move... Well, oh, that's a lovely shot. Gee, I like this bloke. I think he's got tremendous potential. Now, that really is a cracking shot. It has class written all over it. Well, he's hit this one well. Six. Pollock. Over the top again, way down towards the uh, cover boundary and a bounce over the fence for four. Pakistan have decided they're going to get off to a flyer here today. There's a bowling change and that's Callis coming in now. Awkward shot, great shot, straight over his head, first ball, take that. Oh, there he goes again. That's two in the over. Straight down the ground for four. I think he's probably been thinking about this. Hit the ball straight if you're going to hit it in the air. Two very good shots. Down the ground. That's going to be six as well. Over the top she goes. Imran Nazir has taken to this opening the batting like a duck to water. He looks as if he's loving every second of it. Now there's just a chance they'll take a, away this. Oh, good shot, good shot. Straight down the ground. I tell you what, we are seeing some lovely straight hits today. Oh, it's four. Lucky, but it's four. If it's out there, he's going to try and smash it no matter what anyone says. That was short outside off stump. He got a little optimistic, tried to hit it too hard. with a third man 50 to Imran Nazir oh beautifully hit that'll be another four so the 100 comes up in the 18th over There's the 54, Shahid Afridi, a very good one of 46 balls. Oh, that's well played. Kept it fine and got it away from the third. This is a superb opening partnership. That's up in the air. And magnificently taken. That is the catch of the tournament. You won't get to see too many better catches than this. Who runs backwards. And now watch this. This is where it's brilliant. That dive is just incredible. That's out. That's beautifully bowled by Crooks. Wide signal. But the third empire has been called for. And... Imran Nazir, if he's short of his ground, will have to leave the ground. Gets in a hurry. Both the openers now back in the pavilion. Once again, wrapped on the pads. This time, the finger goes up. South Africa are right back into this game. A oh, good shot over the top and for four. Right. Well, perhaps uh, Yusuf Yohana has to. He's nearly killed him. He hit that one back at him like a rocket. <laughs> What's going on, son? That missed me by an inch. Nancy Hayward went down. What good for the cutting that was, wasn't it? You saw Nancy Hayward. <laughs> I never saw a thing. Oh, that's beautifully hit into the gap. Terrific batting there from Yusuf Yohana. 
Pakistan, 184 for three. A lot more talent than uh, the runs he scored. Uh, it's, it's not because I think he, he, the figures are very good. I mean, if you see the average there, Inzamam has done very well. But I, it's just that I think that he's an extremely gifted player and he hasn't really d done himself this, the, the justice he should have. Well, he's now scored more runs in Sharjah than any other player, and that was a beautifully timed shot to bring up the 200. Four for three. Gone. Yusuf Yohana, very disappointed with his departure there. Just clipping that ball uh, straight to the South African captain. Which is why he missed it. And he's been given out. Mohan Khan having a bit of a horror stretch with the bat here in Sharjah. He's out in the 43rd over. Old watching. Full toss and desperate effort by Crooks. That's four though. That one slightly over pitched by Hansi Kronier. Four overs to go. Oh, it's hitting high and wide. Will it go all the way? Yes, one bounce for four. Well played. They're taking advantage of the loose balls. Boys hit that one too, into the gap on the onside. Abdurazak is playing a little gem of a knock, just when it matters. Full toss, he's got it away for four. Another full toss. Inzamam. Mom was trying to knock the ball with the bat. <laughs> That's his half century. That's well played. Very well played. He's in good form. So it'll be a slower ball or it'll be right up there. Oh, well bowled, beautifully bowled by Pollock. He's rolled him over. Was he Macram on strike? He's hit that one in the air, way down towards mid-wicket, bouncing away towards the fence. Will it get there? Yes, four. Can Adol Razak do last ball of the Pakistan innings? Straight down the ground. Wazim will come back for the second. Well, that's the end of uh, a very good effort by Pakistan. Up 123 for the first wicket and then solidity. There's a big appeal, but uh, Wazim wasn't interested. And this one comes back the other way. Post runs of the bat. That's weakly timed. It beats Akram to the boundary. And that's hammered off the back foot. First boundary of the South African innings. Akram continuing. That's it. Taken by Enzimam. The first wicket goes down here for South Africa. And a very important one. The inform gets dismissed. That's played away nicely on the onside. This is a certain boundary. It's a good over for the South Africans. That's a good shot from Jack Callis. Timed it quite nicely. Edged and taken there by Mohan Khan. That's a very good wicket for Pakistan and a good comeback from the young fast bowler. Or oh, nearly another chance there for Mohamed Akram. The ball being edged by the new batsman, Hansi Cronier. Well, that's worth a shout. Now, the umpire may have felt that there was bat first. absolutely smashed over cover by Hansi Cronier on the attack knowing that uh, Waka was punished a bit earlier on trying to keep the, the dominance going what's this ball oh he's gone for it that's a big hit it's in the stands oh yeah so catch it last ball of Akram's over over the top again, that's for that's very well played. Hansi Cronier is taking the pressure off the South Africans with some good lusty hitting. Yeah! 
He's found the gap on that occasion and the boundary. Not a good delivery from Shahid Afridi. Gave uh, Cronier a lot of room outside off stump. That's a big hit. He's got plenty of bat on that. That's sailed over the boundary line. And a very good way to bring up his half century. He goes for the big one, and that's a flat hit. One bounce over the rope. To look a little bit more serious. Oh, that's smashed away and just short. Was it just short? Think it was just short. Chip is 99. Catch it! It's in the air. This is a high one. This will be a six. Will it? Will it be a catch? It's a six. It's a six. That's the 100 partnership. Well, for what an innings Hansi Cronier is playing. That's the 100 partnership between these two. Oh, he's had another go. This could be out. This is going to be out. He's got in. He's got in. He's got in. What a breakthrough. Hansi Cronier, having done all the good work, has tried to do it once too often. Well, Tony, I think your earlier assessment that he could be getting tired, I think that could have played a... That could have been a factor in that because it was a shot of a guy who was exhausted. That's a good shot. A very smart shot using the bowler's pace. A handy boundary for South Africa. Well, that's uh, well played. Boucher gave himself a little bit of room. So, a couple of boundaries there will just ease the situation a little for South Africa. Well, he's done well. He's got a boundary which is uh, perfect for South Africa. There's a long, but it's hit too far for him. Well, there's the slogger's bats come out, the heavy one. He got enough of a piece of it. I don't think it came cleanly out the middle for Mark Boucher, but he had momentum going forward into the shot. Oh, that's beautifully struck. Right into the gap. He's hit that pretty well, and he's found the gap, but uh, didn't need to find the gap. He's just cleared the rope. Catch it! Catch it, and he does exactly that. So Neil McKenzie, after a long innings, has got the leading edge, and Pakistan have a much-needed wicket, both here and in India. out there from Waka Yunus and he's found the edge without even needing to slip. Big wicket for Pakistan. A little bit of reverse swing. Thanks Ian. Well this now is very interesting. 65 to win, 57 balls. Well, he's bowled him, he's bowled him, first ball he's bowled him, he's bowled him, Pakistan are back in business. There's a celebration out there at the moment. An unparalleled celebration. Well, he's just shaking his head. He didn't see it. He's had a bad time with a bat. Klusner's gone from being unbelievably effective to going through a really bad patch. Have another look at this dismissal. Pollock, the new batsman. Wakai Yunus walks in. The ground's alive. Played away on the onside. He's got a good temperament too, Sean Pollock. Back Oh, look at that cover drive. It goes screaming through the offside field, and that'll go for four as well. That's a brilliant shot. Boucher is just continuing to play shots, and they all hitting the middle of the bat. In fact, Tony, I would have brought the scene in the previous over, because uh, if the equation is as simple as getting a wicket right now to stop the South African run flow, then it's got to be taken. Oh, he's hit that well. That's four. That'll relieve the pressure for South Africa. On ball him. He's bowled him. Clean ball him. Walker again. Walker again. If you keep bowling dead straight, the batsman misses. You've got him. Well, it'll be interesting to see that replay.
That could be the turning point in this match. Sean Pollock out, bowled by Waka Yunus. That's in the air. This is going to be caught. It's going to be caught. Oh, he's dropped him. He's dropped him. Well, well, he had a huge roar in the stadium after Rizak. Such a safe fielder, too, in normal circumstances. 33 to win off 22. He's in it for six. He's in it for six. Into the crowd. Into the... What a player he is. This little bloke is dynamite. He's hit that right off the middle of the bat. The ball after being dropped for six. Nice ball of the over. Can he get a one away here? Oh, he's him. That's it. He's bowled him. He's bowled him. What's in that cram? the end of it, Abdul Razak, a big sigh of relief having dropped that catch, he's knocked the stumps down and I think you can see it written all over his face, Pakistan have taken away the Coca-Cola Cup 2000. But not close enough, Mackenzie, Cronier and Boucher getting the by 16 runs.